Davido, the king of Afrobeat. Hmm? Somebody will talk that will give Davido the king of Afrobeat. <laughs> if you check now, Davido can argue that fact that he's the king of Afrobeat. In fact, uh, a lot of media outlets out there and there are also chat companies, music companies out there, do regard David O as the king of Afrobeat. Why some other chat companies as well do regard Whiskey as the king of Afrobeat. Others regard Bonner Boy as the king of Afrobeat. So David O can be king of Afrobeat to you. But David O can't be king of Afrobeat to me. Or Whiskey can't be to me. Or Bonner Boy can't be to me. It depends on who you want to be your king of Afrobeat. Eh? So if I say David O that the king of Afrobeat, may no pain you for body. Eh? May no pain you for body. You shouldn't may no pain you at all. And again, if you tell me, say David Do or Whiskey or Bona Bona the King of Afrobeat, you know pay me for body because according to your book. According to the way you don't see that artist for a long time, depending on what you don't do, the kind of music you don't release, how the top chart and how they scatter everywhere with music, or his behavior, his behavior, you can decide to name anybody the king of Afrobeat according to your book. So, it's not a topic that we should be even be arguing about. King of Afrobeat or no king of Afrobeat, you no know, concern anybody. Hmm? David O, the king of Afrobeat, or possibly one of the kings of Afrobeat. We we already have a prince of Afrobeat, and that is Rema. Rema is regarded as a prince of Afrobeat. Only mm, very soon now, uh, very soon as you see, uh, fans go to bring entertainers. Uh, Rema set to pick the one maker will be prince of Afrobeat. Rema is regarded as a prince of Afrobeat. Well. David is celebrating big 31 years old yesterday. 31 years old. Man. I I I see now David with with um, let me maybe one or one year or two. Uh, okay. May, may I not talk my age, but I see now David and uh, the guy, man. Or well, the guy get money past my papa. Yeah. <laughs> he get money past me who oh. But uh, big uh, congratulations, or should I say happy birthday to David O celebrating his 31th birthday with uh, his family, his friends. He even organized a party uh, yesterday night, and uh, Choma was there as usual now. I'm very, very happy that Choma and David Do are now coming out showing themselves to public. You know, some people do not like Choma and David Do showing themselves out in public. Let me be honest, guys. The other day, someone wrote me on my telegram. He said, David Do and Choma are now coming out on, on in public now, showing themselves again. This is how they are showing off until one tragic thing happened to them. They, they will start going back again. They don't learn from their lesson. Uh uh. You call one me person, come day in door for a whole rest of your life, may not live your life again. Eh? Just because of one tragic event or multiple tragic events, me person, no live your life again. Me person no flinch or me person no carry on with his life. Come on now. Come on. Hmm? One issue no go make you go sleep for a side room, confess in a dear world end now. Eh? Well, because of waiting people do, people will talk. Me no call live your life. Now even Choma even do herself self. Choma for don't come as I sins. They live a life as the as the only wife of uh of uh, David Doe. I don't know why she decided to stay very quiet. Maybe, of course, she was pregnant and not sure the pregnancy. But I don't, I don't know why she tried to stay. Before she for she no send anybody, Papa. Honestly, she 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 wouldn't have sent at all. She for continue living her life because at the end of the day, people will talk and talk and talk and talk and talk. They will still talk and it's in a way the same thing that they have been in waiting for years. So if I be Choma, we don't come outside since. So well, they are outside doing their stuff and enjoying themselves as usual. Nothing they happen. And uh, you know, yesterday, uh, two days ago, David also sold out a wave festival. And uh, because of what he did, because of uh, selling out a twenty-two thousand capacity 
uh, uh, stadium. And not just only that guy, because of a contribution towards Atlanta City. Guess what? Libido was awarded a bit. I said the 61st major of uh, Atlanta, Andre Dick, uh, Dick, uh, Dick in, and the Fountain Council Board of Commissioner recognized David Doe's contribution towards entertainment in the city of Atlanta. The 21st of November has now been proclaimed as David Doe Appreciation Day in the city of Fountain County, Georgia. You see, uh, it was signed and sealed, city of Atlanta. It was signed and sealed by multiple officers. Multiple officers. I think about, let me count it, about 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 15, 16 government officers signed and sealed that day. 21st November as David Doe Appreciation Day in Atlanta City. Wow. That's great, though. Mm -hmm. That's great. Really, really great, guys. That's nice. And I checked this right up coming, you know, celebration of uh, David Doe's uh, birthday. Uh, Obama, Obama, who was uh, Obama DMW, you know, the Obama president, who, Obama DMW son. You know, Obama is late, and uh, David Doe took over the responsibility of that boy. You know, celebrating birthday, his birthday, he decided to write this very long, loving letter. He said, Dad, I am writing this from the bottom of my heart. Keeping a promise is one of the hardest things in life. You promised to help me since I lost my father. You have never rejected me. You love me just the way a father should love his child. Every video of hers, you always say, my son, Dad, my father would be so grateful for all you do for me. I love you so much. There was a day I was so broke, broken, but when we spoke, it, it didn't just solve my issue. He spoke to me, my son. Hope you really good. This world is so genuine and loving. Happy birthday to my father's friend. Someone to cry to, someone who cares, someone who loves me, to a father, to a legend, to a humble-hearted man, to a gifted man, to a talented man, to a very handsome man, to someone who a smile can give a soul. I love you so much. I love, I love everything you you have. You love every. Enjoy your day. Your, your, your year, everything about you, enjoy it. Almighty Father in heaven, please bless him with your love, your grace and your mercy, and fill his life with your goodness and your light. May my dad feel your presence in his life, guiding him along the path of righteousness and peace. That's going from Obama DMW son. That is a that is a child who knows exactly what he's doing. That is a child that is worthy to be helped. You know, David Doe really, really, after Obama died, Obama made a promise to, to Obama. And David Doe made a promise to Obama that, see, I got your son, man. Your son no will ever suffer. And, of course, through the testimony of that boy, you know the guy, nothing they touch him. You know the guy, nothing they touch and The guy is good. Not hungry, not uh, not scared of anything. This guy is good. He's, he's set for life. If he finish school now, you know, job day for him. Well, for him to work, you know, work in a very very nice place to move on from there. Job day for him. Well, so his his life is set. And the able the governor of uh, Oshun State, that David Owanko. Even wrote, uh, wrote a message uh, to David. He said, Happy birthday, David. Oh, I vividly remember when you shared your music aspiration with me years ago. Play me your EP. I encourage you to aim higher. And now, as a multiple Grammy Award nominee, philanthropist, all around great guy, I'm incredibly proud of the man you have become. 
Even Oshu State Governor, no Bible, send happy birthday to your own son before. Eh? But they will do, we know what they will do, do for this governor during the election. We know the insult that they will do are accumulated. We know how they will do come out, put a life on the weeks. Like the move for street and everything, just to rally support for his uncle. So the guy actually deserved that praise from that uncle. But David Doe is one of those guys, he's exactly like his father. I go very, very hard when it comes to family. Big 31, 31 years old. And of course, we see David Doe has finally decided to post picture of his newborn baby, but not the faces, so he's not posting any face. You know what? Maybe you not go carry a picking face. Go take a do babalawu. Carry a picking face. Go take do ritualism and do things. You know, you, you see why people need to be careful. Now, David Doe was extremely, really, really free before when it comes to his family. Life has taught him a lesson. Life has taught him a lesson. Someone now, someone wrote to say, why are you all covering the child's face? Life has taught David Doe a lesson. And if not me, self, eh, I will able to do worse than what he knew. I'm not going to see any picture concerning any, any, any picture concerning any of my child again. That's exactly how you say, and now all, all the children will grow old, well. Life, life, life will humble you. Life has taught him a lesson. Hard way. So that became pictures, eh? all those pictures you see very free. You find pictures were everywhere. You find pictures, advert, everything. Was well, the face of when it comes to kids. Advert and everything. You find was the face. So it was just too much. The pressure was too much on that little child. The pressure was too much. So now he has learned his lesson. You think he will go back to that kind of rubbish things? Maybe. Like, like oh, if not me, if not you, will you will go back, go to the Mumu uh, as to think uh, the before. Even Choma said no will agree. <laughs> Choma will fight and he no will agree. He no go allow him make a day with carry big and come inside just the way they can before. Like, like no agree. He no care about fame and everything. Choma will not allow it. 